When considering car finance, you need to decide your finance term, the period over which you will spread your repayments. For most people, this tends to be two to four years, but in deciding what's right for you, you first need to consider how long you want to keep the car before selling it or trading it in for a new one. You might prefer to change your vehicle regularly, especially if you like to keep up with improvements in performance and rapidly changing technology. For example, did you know that a car made in 2003 will have no navigation system or aux input for a phone or digital music, no side airbags or anti-lock brakes, and no factory-fitted parking sensors? And some models which averaged 40 miles per gallon back then now have equivalents that do 70 miles per gallon today. Or because you get reassurance from knowing your car is still under warranty and likely to be more reliable than an older model. It also makes sense to balance depreciation with maintenance costs. Annual repair and servicing costs often rise significantly after about 30,000 miles, when many warranty periods end. So when maintenance costs are more than finance costs for a new car, it could be time to change. In summary, to decide on your finance term, you should consider your annual mileage, what you can afford to pay monthly, and at what point it will become cost-effective or simply desirable and affordable for you to upgrade to a new car. It's that simple.